Artificial intelligence image generators are a great way to practice your language and intercultural skills. Visit a tool like Midjourney, Dolly, Crayon, or Bing and give these ideas a try. Idea number one, refine your language skills. The best AI users know how to craft precise queries to match their needs. Experiment using nouns with vibrant descriptors to see how you can refine the AI images generated for you. For example, you may find that you want to reference particular forms or image types, like drawings or photographs, or particular artistic movements, like cubism or Afrofuturism. You will find that working with this level of detail will provide better outcomes than leaning on subjective and vague terms like interesting or moody. Idea number two, compare and contrast images across languages or time periods. Ask the AI to generate images from two time periods that are relevant to your target language study and compare and contrast these images. Or provide the same input but in two different languages and see if the language seems to impact the output at all. After comparing and contrasting, form hypotheses of why the differences might be there and investigate with some research. Idea number three, use a thinking routine to analyze the images. Harvard's Project Zero offers a ton of thinking routines to help you process images. Go to pz.harvard.edu backslash thinking dash routines to check them out. You may want to start with the investigating objects and systems or the perspective taking categories when checking out the ones you like best. Now that you have an idea about where to begin, start running queries. These images are a great way to promote gaining a new layer of intercultural understanding and awareness. Did you enjoy this video? Don't forget to like and subscribe.